ladies. Ladies and gents. All right, guys, another mini so today. Uh, we're really knocking out some this week. I'm just trying to get some content rolling before our really big plans start kicking off here later this summer. Um, I want to start by talking about our buddy Mark. Uh, we went over and did some uh, work at his farm. I shouldn't say work. I should say we did a little walkthrough at his farm uh, that he hunts. Just to give him an idea, he wants to get into the food plot game for the first time. I think he's done them in the past, but it's been a while. So he just wanted me to walk you with him, have a look, see what's going on there, um, his options. He does have a very nice spot for one. He just got a new uh, elevated tower as well. It's going to be uh, pretty cool for him this fall. Uh, Mark helps me run the Medina County Hunters Big Buck Contest, which has been a lot of fun and very successful. Uh, and he's been on the winning team two years in a row. He's two different teams that he's been on, but he's won two years in a row. So I'm sure I'll hear all about that in the future. He's going for his three-peat. And maybe we'll have something to do about that this year. But um, so we went and walked Mark's farm. And then we also spent a weekend in Pennsylvania. Uh, we'll be showing some of that stuff. We went fishing. Luke caught a bunch. The leaky John boat Luke caught himself a bunch of uh, smallmouth and a native trout. Um, that's going to be on his channel. I'll show you a little preview, but I'll send you guys that way. Uh, we went tubing and then finished up some stuff here at the home farm. Uh, a little bit of food plot stuff, check some cameras, nothing too crazy. But uh, we're going to get into some heavy food plot stuff here in the next month. Uh, I know Nick's going to be putting in a big one. I'm going to be redoing my most important food plot. And then uh, we might put some in at some of our other satellite farms and definitely probably one down at the Gore Farm. So food plots will be the big uh, topic over the next month or so. But uh, I'll wrap this interview up. I'll get you straight into the footage. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy the stuff. Remember, please like and subscribe to the channel. Always helps us out. Some nice ones. Yeah. What's the biggest one you've seen so far, Isaac? Like, like a, a 50 or 17 right there. Oh. What? What? Uh-oh. Blown away. Yeah, you suck. You suck again. No, he's still alive. Brett Michaels, Brett Michaels is every rose that has a store poison. You got any messages, Bill? Keep drinking. Keep drinking. We're here with the leaky John boat himself. Yep. Caught some good fish, he said. One, yeah. No, trout fishing didn't go that good. But. No trout, huh? Just some smallies? One trout, one little trout. Yeah. There's some nice smallies. You said there were people playing beer pong in your hole? Yeah, I walked. It's summertime. Now. Yeah, it's summertime. People playing beer pong. It's, it's summertime. Who would ever do such a thing? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Ryan. How about you? Yep. Someone's got to do it. So do those. Thanks, Ryan. Famous Nick Schlau campfire steaks. Yeah, I'm going to get a video of my, my beautiful wife. Toast. She'll be so pissed. She'll be so pissed. I would be pissed. Can't taste it. Ever since that, 
here with the leaky John boat himself. We're gonna catch some smallies. Pennsylvania smallmouth fishing. Hopefully enough for him to have an episode and us to have a mini sode. We'll this see. This is my second episode, part two. Yeah, we'll see. Morning, how, so. We'll see how it goes. I mean, they're they're there to the right. I see him. We're gonna cast down here. We're gonna get down there in a second. I just wanna see if I can catch I still got it. I'll still be able to tie a knot without having to squint. It's nice getting here in the morning before all the recreational water users and tubers and stuff. There we go. That is a way nicer fish. He hit it right in the shallow, actually, on the other side of this pool. He has actually got some real size to him. I'm try to get him up over here. He is really nice. That is exactly what we're looking for when we're trying to catch some tie nests and smallmouth. He is just an absolute toad. Come here. Here we go. And he is actually barely hooked. But that is a beautiful time that's a small egg. I'll let him get back in the water. He's just gonna swim right off. We're gonna try that again using this. All right guys, finished up this mini soda real quick uh, with the last of my brownings that I have on video mode. Uh, here's my screening that I put in. It's really starting to pop now that we finally got some rain. Clover Megaplot, one of our Radix. Uh, put new batteries in a bunch of the cell cams today and move some stuff around so we won't be messing with cams again for probably at least a month or so. We got a lot of stuff to do. Cams are all set. Uh, the rest of this episode is just going to be some uh, footage of deer. And we hope you guys enjoy it.